It's Saturday deep into the afternoon. It's 5 o'clock p.m. I was up at 1.30 and then I got roped into a Skype call and yeah, that turned into a 3.30 thing. And then right then I was like, okay, I'm gonna go have a shower because I really feel gross today. I don't know why, but I, my body felt clammy. So I was like, frig it, we'll go have a shower. And nope, 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 Skype goes off again. Then my phone starts going off and I'm like, for freak's sake. So I dealt with all that. Finally had a shower at 4.45. It's five o'clock now, finally picking up the camera. Yeah, I have absolutely no idea what is going on tonight. One thing I do know is I'm finally done editing all those Grand Theft Auto Online videos. Holy shit, there was a lot of them. Yeppers. So, uh, I know Jules is working for another hour. She works until 6, and then I don't know what's happening there. So, right now I'm just chillaxing, uh, you know, enjoying a little, a little vape. And uh, probably going to make a pot of coffee, I'm thinking, maybe, probably, I don't know. Just going to roll with it, and welcome to my vlog. Barking. I'm just coming downstairs to get some water. Killed my gallon jug. Killed it last night. There's a little bit left, so yep a dip. Gonna fill her up with water. So, like I said, I have no idea what's going on. Jules is off in an hour. I don't know if I'm heading over there. Rex wants to do coffee tonight. I don't know if I feel like doing coffee tonight. I don't know. Everything's up in the air. It's freaking cold out though right now, let me tell you. Don't let the sunlight outside fool you one bit. It's not exactly a a nice day out, but that's fine. But, uh, how oh well, how oh well. Just another typical Saturday, and tomorrow, Dad wants me to go over, and he's like, Yo, you coming over tomorrow for supper and things? And I'm like, I guess. What's for supper? He's like, garlic bread and lasagna. And I was like, oh, sounds great. And he goes, awesome. He goes, oh, yeah, and I got something I want you to look at on my computer. Oh, oh, you know? Freaking, freaking gets me with the food. Garlic bread and lasagna, and I'm like, Sounds delish. Oh yeah, my computer's dicked again. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh well, he wants to show me a bunch of stuff. He got that G-Box in and stuff. And uh, to me, the G-Box looks like it's just a any old kind of Android TV, smart TV add-on running XBMC. So theoretically, that Acer piece of shit I have downstairs, I can install XBMC on that and have the same effect. So for me, a G-Box, not really worth it. Well, seeing how theoretically it is supper time, theoretically, I think I'm going to make something to eat. And I'm thinking, I took out one of those hams that I bought a while back out of the freezer, threw it in the fridge to thaw out. Not sure what the condition of it is. Oh yeah, she's thawed. One, one of these guys, eh? One of these jobbies. These uh, uh, apparent Black Forest smoked hams. So I'm going to do it like Bloke did uh, in the oven. Once I find my pan, I'll be right back while I hunt for gear. Well, it's definitely kind of big, but uh, this will work in, in there. You know, plop it in, tinfo cover it, maybe. I don't know. We'll try it. <laughs> so uh, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. We'll plop her in there. We'll get her all ready. And then uh, I'm going to throw some rice on in the rice cooker. And quite possibly do some veg on the stovetop. So that way there we'll have some nice cooked ham, some veg and some rice, have ourselves a nice nutritious dinner, and have some leftovers for later on next week or whatever. So that'd be awesome. Alrighty, the rice is cooking. The ham is ready for the oven. Just gotta wait for the oven to preheat to 325. Yeah, weird, weird temperature. Normally it's 375 for stuff for 400, right? 325 for 30 minutes. So we'll let that do its thing, we'll let this do its thing. When I was cutting the ham out of the packaging, because those blister packs, they don't open with ease, freaking thing, I leaked a bunch of ham juice, and I got some on my camera. No, my camera, the, he wants to eat my camera. Yes, he does, because it smells like a piece of ham, right, buddy? You know, can I help you? <laughs> oh, he's nuts. Alrighty, well the rice is still cooking. I did a bunch of dishes, still got some left in there to do, but this sink is pretty much empty. Ham's in the oven, got 25 minutes left on the cook. I'm going to get some veg boiling up there shortly. And uh, yeah, I'm going to have some veg. What am I going to have for veg? Well, um, probably going to cook up this bag of Japanese mix. Oh, rig it. 
So we'll have ham, Japanese mix, and rice for supper tonight. Tomorrow night I don't need to cook. It's so like I said, I'm going to my parents' house. Mom's making lasagna and garlic bread. So, freak yeah. Yeah, I love that kind. Should get the camera guy so excited. But, um, yep and dip. That's the battle plan. Gonna cook up some veggies and have some veggies, some rice, and some freaking ham. It'll be an awesome supper, I think. I figure while I wait for food to cook, I might as well start the uploads in the Grand Theft Auto 5 videos. Uh, I'm uploading uh, the gameplays and scheduling them in, getting them out of the way. And yeah. Yeah. So out of three, uh, I thought it was four and a half hours of video footage. It was only three and a half hours of online play. I was able to make 12 online videos that uh, they're pretty. Oh my god, does it ever smell good down here? It smells like ham, like you wouldn't believe. But uh, I was able to make 12 videos. So what I'm planning on doing with those is I'm not going to upload them all back to back for 12 days. I'm going to run them in sync with other games like Minecraft and stuff. So there will be like one day will be Minecraft and the Grand Theft Auto single player. Next day it could be like Cities Excel and Grand Theft Auto City player. Or uh, one player, you know. I'm thinking about doing them like that just because then I can spread them out longer. And... Um, you know, I can work on other things, not really video gaming, but I still need to play a lot of Minecraft and stuff, and people are like, oh, you know, you gotta get off the computer and go do other things. Well, I like playing video games. I like computers. That's that's my thing. That's what I do. So, you know, whatevs. Like, I'm in the tech. I'm in the computers. I'm not really into the wilderness and the outdoors and stuff. There's, like, animals and things out there that scare me a little bit. Oh, man, when the rice gets like this, you should smell my house right now. It's delicious. Like, look at him. He's, he, he, he can smell it, and it's driving him completely wampus. He really, really, really wants whatever smells good. Right? See, told you. Man, I'm really enjoying this ice cap vape ever since I steeped it. That was a brilliant idea. Thank you, big time guys, for mentioning that. It literally now tastes like a Tim Hortons uh, coffee with milk and sugar. So, it's delicious. I'm really, really enjoying this one here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's working really well, and, um, yeah, like, uh, I was just chatting with my cousin, and he says the vape is working, but it's not the same as smoking cigarettes. And I was like, oh, and he goes, yeah, he goes, I've been sneaking a cigarette here and there. He goes, uh, doing a lot better than I was before, you know, he used to kill a pack a day. He goes, now, you know, he might, he vapes all day and stuff, but every once in a while he just needs that cigarette, so he has a cigarette. So he may be smoking one or two cigarettes a day, so a pack will last him a good week. But, uh... You know, the, the problem I find with vaping is it's a good alternative to smoking, but only if you're ready to pack up smoking. If you are not ready to pack up smoking, you still like cigarettes, you still want to smoke, vaping won't work for you. That's a given. Vaping will not work. you got to not want the cigarettes, and then vaping will work. So, for me, I've been wanting to quit for a while. You guys have been yelling at me to quit for a while, and I knew I had to quit for a while. Like I said in the past, I've tried everything. I've tried Champix. I wouldn't do Zyban or Wellbutrim because of the side effects. I've tried uh, the patch. That was a bad experience. My skin got really irritated. I've tried the gum. That was disgusting. I'll never do that again. Tried the mints. Also disgusting. Never do that again. Only thing I didn't try was the inhaler. And I don't know if you guys ever seen these nicotine inhalers, but they're like, it's like the tip of, of this thing here. And what you do is you take it out of the package, you crack it, put it to your lips, and go and it gives you a straight shot of nicotine that's good for about two and a half hours your body won't crave nicotine for two and a half hours because you get a nice concentrated dose well that's no different than vaping in my mind except for this isn't as concentrated you know every toot you probably get around two to three not even probably one or two milligrams of nicotine per toot because I'm running the 18 milligrams per, per uh, milliliter and uh, I'm not even like uh, so far since last night when I filled this with the ice cap, I filled it to 2.4 mil. I'm down to 2 mil, so I've used 0.4 of a mil so far. So the, the inhalers give you a stronger hit, but the problem is, is I just, I don't know. I, I just don't really, I never tried them. They probably do work. They probably would have worked great for me, but uh, this is working good. It's keeping me off the cigarettes. It's been officially three weeks now, people. As of an hour ago, it's been three weeks that I've had my last cigarette. And honestly, I don't miss it one friggin' bit. Yeah, buddy. 
So it seems a lot of you like the fact that I did Flyer Day yesterday, so that's right on, you know. I don't mind doing Flyer Day. I just thought it was kind of pointless because, you know, it only affects like maybe a handful of, uh, of my viewers who live in Canada and have, you know, those stores. So that's why I didn't bother doing it anymore, and that's why it was like five weeks, and then finally I did it. But it seems like a lot of you are commenting, yeah, Flyer Day, I love that kind of things and stuff, so maybe I need to start doing it again every Friday. Maybe I will. But uh, did you guys notice that? Freaking Christmas? They're already talking about Christmas? Like, the day after Halloween? What the shit is up with that? You know? Like, Remembrance Day is coming up November 11th, and I already know people who have their Christmas decorations up, and somebody posted on Facebook, and I kind of like this, please put up your decorations after November 12th. Respect our veterans. That's right. Respect our veterans. You know? Frig sakes. Like... If I go into Walmart anytime this week and they have Christmas music pinned, I am going to lose my shit. Alrighty, the rice is done. The vegetables are done. The succulent ham is done. Now to take it out of that pot, put it on my cutting board, chop it up into slices, put some on a plate, eat, pack the rest up for another day. Yeah, let's go. Alrighty, well there's my supper for tonight. We got some rice, we got some freaking veg, we got some ham. It's om nom time. Let's go eat. Alrighty, well, there's a slight change in plans for tonight. I'm gonna head over to Jules' house. I was gonna get her to cut my hair, but her ex still has her hair cutting stuff, so she doesn't have her razors. So I was thinking, why don't I just get my own? And that way there, you know, maybe set up a couple mirrors in the bathroom. I might be able to cut my own hair at times. You know, make myself look like an idiot and things. But if I have my own razor, then I'm ready to rock. But first, I need to rock a shit, and then it's off to Walmart. Oh, God. Thank God that's over. Frig's sakes. Couldn't stand the way that it was. But, uh, just gonna let Scruffy out. I'm gonna go potty. And then we're gonna head off to Walmart, pick up that razor kit. They're about 20 bucks. And then, uh, I guess uh, we'll head over to Jules' house, hang out there for a bit. Where'd my Scruffy go? Scruffy. Oreo? Eh, who knows where he is. He'll come back. He always does. And then, uh, well, yeah, we'll head over to Jules and get a haircut and friggin' hammer down. Because, as you can tell, I desperately need a freaking haircut. Some bitch pile of monkey nuts do I ever. I just vaped myself out. Okay, so Oreo's back in the house. I'm gonna head over to Walmart right now. For freaking sakes. And uh, grab the shit that I need. So let's put a pattern and have at her. And then we'll head over to Jules' house, hang out there for a bit, and come back home. So, let's go. This might take longer than I thought. The window is all fogged up on the inside. I need to wash my window, and then I need to put this stuff on that I bought that'll keep the freezing from happening on the inside of the windscreen. But uh, it's gonna take it a bit to heat up. It's currently minus two out, and yeah. Should've probably let my car heat up for about five minutes before I came out here. Ah well, freak sakes. It's not like I don't have things, like, you know, oh, whatevs. Every day I'm vaping. All right, people, I'm down here at Walmart, gonna head inside, pick up what I need, and we'll get out of here. So let's freaking do this. All right, so that's what I bought. Just a simple razor with attachments, 20 bucks. Hopefully it does the job. I guess we'll find out. Let's head over to Jules. Okay, so I'm over here at Jules' house. And I got the razor, and she's playing with the, yeah, the apron or whatever the hell it's called. And uh, here's the kit. So you get this nice juicy beefy razor. Feels kind of cheap though, Can but 20 these? bucks. What do you expect? Uh, sure. I don't know what the hell they're for. When you have long hair like this, you go like this. When you're straightening it, and you go like this, and it holds it out of the way. Oh. Well, it's not that bad. I think there's but two. But I always them. lose them, so I like to. So steal I don't them. need those. All I need is these these colorful things. Get some I'm gonna keep to the trim, comb. Cut the hair out of your your your. Uh, yeah, on my nostril. Well, no, I'm thinking off of your lips. A little brush away. to clean up after you're done shaving. No. It oh. cleans this to get the hair oh, out of that. Oh, well, for frig's sakes, and um, yeah. You need to lube it first. Oh, you gotta, you gotta lube it. You always lube it before you <laughs> use it, people. That applies for more than just razors. You so. Lube it. so we're gonna lube it and then we're gonna get me a haircut because I desperately need one because I've been getting headaches from this nonsense. I'm sorry. <laughs> Before, after. Yep, we almost can make another Oreo. Oh my god. Well guys, I have a feeling Jules' video will not be up in time. 
Yep. I don't want to have an epic fail my first video. Yeah, it's going to be a little... Gonna be 935 minutes late. It's currently I don't deciding know. on what it wants. It's to currently 9:30 at night, and um, it's gonna take a little. I bit. have faith. Cause you gotta have faith, faith, faith. Ah, uh. skiddle douche, skiddle deedle deedle douche, deedle 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 douche, skiddle deedle deedle douche. After a late night of hair cutting, Jules and I decided to have vape sex. This is how you have vape sex. I don't have as much smoke as you. And she's preggers. It's We're gonna good. be a mini vape. A mini vape. A little 400 milliamp bastard. Yeah. It's a two cha cha. Yeah. Twin cha cha. <laughs> Twin cha cha. I think she's sleepy. Alrighty, people. Well, it's currently almost 11 o'clock. Jules is still trying to upload her video. God knows when that's going to happen. And uh, yeah, I'm going to head her home. So let's pit her patter and have at her and head her home. And we are back home. Yeah, buddy. So, got my new haircut. I'm going to Jules for a bit. Now back home. Not sure what's going on. No text messages. Got an email. That's about it. So, yeah, buddy. So you want back in? You want back in? Oreo? Bacon? Stupid dog. Friggin' dog's just trolling me. But it's 11 o'clock at night now. And, uh, yeah, I didn't really do too much today. But, uh, whatevs, it's the weekend, and I felt like vegging, and that's what I did. So, look amigo. So, on that note, if you liked today's video, click that like button. Questions, comments, concerns, down below they go. Tomorrow, I gotta go to my parents' house. Some bitch pile monkey nuts. So, until next time, keep on vlogging.